What's up people? Welcome back to another video of Life of Kush. Today I'm going to show you how to make an incubator for birds. I, I um, can't really use it for reptiles, but I guess you can modify it for reptiles. I might try that one day, but for now, it's just for like poultry, birds. Yeah? So, I'm going to go through step by step. It's not, that, it's not that long, to be honest. So, first of all... <laughs> I'm going to start by making a window and so my light's going to be going on this side here so I want my window about there so I'll draw I'm going to draw around I'm going to draw around and then I'm going to make another another drawing around there so I'm not sure if you can see that yeah you can so here's the outline and I'll be cutting this line and then le leaving this one. Some people do, um, will go down ha like halfway on this bit. So the screen can actually fit kind of, oh gosh, fit kind of half inside. But in case I mess it up, I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to cut that inner line out and I'm just going to stick it down like that one there. So, I'll cut it out, and I'll be back. Oh, what am I cutting it with? <clears throat> just got my... Just got that. So, I'm just going to keep doing lines, and then hopefully it comes out nice. So, here we go. The first hole's been made. So, I'll leave that outline in, like I said, just in case I do mess it up. Leave that. So, just, oh, just so you can get an idea. So yeah, it'll be like that. You can you can see, you can still see it's there. So that's all good. Now, uh, what I'm gonna do just to make it look a bit better, I'm gonna get heat tape and it go over these bits with heat tape. I'm guessing it should stop heat loss as well. And then next. I need to put the bulb uh, hole here, so it's going this side. I did, like on, on this one. I did have it at the top, but it just seemed like it was hard work when uh, I'd take lid off to turn them. So yeah, just gonna put that here. So I'm gonna do the circle on that. Like I never left people, <clears throat> so you can see. I've put that there, that's all, that bit's all done, and then, I've got that bit done, got the little nook in there, one sec, show you the fit, oh, my camera skills are terrible today, I don't know what's going on, sorry, so, uh, as you can see, that fits nicely, then I'll turn it round, can't really push because I'm doing it one-handed oh there we go that's how it'll be nicely so I'll we'll probably go around there with some tape or something just to keep it steady so yeah that light bulbs there now I need to make a hole down there for the thermostat and I also need to make a hole down there for the fan so I'll do that, and again, I'll be back. <laughs> back. Here's the front screen. Let me go in. Got a little thermostat here. And then, obviously, where the bulb's going to be. Then, oh, if we stay here, the fan will be directly under the bulb. So it's circulating the hot air. I'm going to be filling all of this up with foil just so heat rebounds everywhere i don't know if i have to but i've done it in the other so might as well do it here why change oh and it keeps it clean as well i'm back again so here's the setup looking good looking good so we can see when we come here 
we can see all the way around everywhere so it has worked out to be quite nice i've just turned it on so it's uh getting just getting up to temperature so that fan i just bought from asda because yeah at the time i was building my other incubator i didn't couldn't get like other people use pc fans but that's worked fine for me and it's easy to replace only a fiver i think it was as well so can lose really it's aiming up at the light so it pushes all the hot air around so it's even and yeah it's just a nice little setup really doesn't cost too much i think the boss box costs like 20 pounds uh the thermostat costs about 20 pound so you're looking at maybe between 40 40 60 pound and it's quite big it's quite that this is a a4 size so you can kind of uh work it out so it's time to put some eggs in i think 